the field, locked away for the WS Cox Plate. The Wait for Aids Championship coming up. This is it, they're racing. And the starter sent them away well. Now let's uh, have a look where Bone Crusher is back behind them at the rear as they settle down trying to get near the fence and our Waverley Stars caught deep. Stewart's pulled the whip on Bone Crusher. Our Waverley Stars going better than Bone Crusher near the turn. Stewart riding desperately on Bone Crusher. Our Waverley Star leads him by about a length. They've cleared away from the opposition. Drought in third placing, followed by Dinky Flyer and Drawn. Here's Bone Crusher raising another effort. The two New Zealanders turn for home with Bone Crusher. A narrow leader from our Waverley Star. The Filbert battling on. Bone Crusher and our Waverley Star. Stride for stride from the Filbert. This is worth coming miles to see the bone crusher on the outside they hit the line bone crusher beat our waverly star in one of the greatest races ever 300 to go waverly star the leader three quarters bone crusher is under the whip in second placing three links to drought around the home turn and it's our waverly star the leader but bone crusher responds bone crusher's race to the front now from our waverly star then drought and the filbert bone crusher and neck in front our Waverly Star's coming again on the inside. Our Waverly Star getting the Bone Crusher. Bone Crusher and our Waverly Star, they hit the line. Oh no, Bone Crusher. Bone Crusher's wanted to hit our Waverly Star. Third is the Filbert. That is the best race you'll ever see anywhere in Australasia. Waverly Star's about three quarters to Bone Crusher. They're both under the whip. Four links to drought. Then Drawn and Dinky Flyer on the turn. These two mighty chestnuts, Waverly Star a long neck, the Bone Crusher draws level. Three to Drought running on the Filbert. Bone Crusher's taken the lead from Waverly Star. The Filbert running on the Bone Crusher a neck in front. Waverly Star comes at him. 50 to go. Bone Crusher and Waverly Star, they're going to hit it together. Bone Crusher and Waverly Star, the Bone Crusher. The greatest race I've ever seen. They've got 1,100 to go. Roman Artist cutting out a fair pace. Out a length and a half. Society Bay, clear second now. On the rails, Dandy Andy and a half length to March Akita. Two lengths to draw and having a good run from Imprimata. Our Waverly Star will want to be fail up. Here's Bone Crusher. He's pulled into the outside, shooting around them, and our Waverly Star's going with it. Aberity at the head of the others with Drought, Dinky Flyer, the Filbert and Tristram. Here come the New Zealanders, our Waverly Star and Bone Crusher. They've raced to the lead, 600 out, have they gone too early? Two lengths to Drought running up the third from Society Bay. They were followed then by Drawn under the whip at the head of the others, Dinky Flyer. But our Waverly Star, he got a half length of Bone Crusher. He's gone for the whip on Bone Crusher. Three lengths to Drought, followed then by Dinky Flyer and Drawn. But the two great New Zealanders have come away on the turn. Our Waverly Star, a half-length Bone Crusher. The Big Red won't give in. Drought running on. Bone Crusher responds to the whip. The roars of the crowd. He races up to our Waverly Star. A hundred out. Bone Crusher, our Waverly Star. Stride for stride. Nothing in it. Our Waverly Star, the rails. Bone Crusher, the outside. And Bone Crusher races into equine immortality. One and a half million dollars as he photo finishes our Waverley Star. Third is the Filbert, followed by Drought. Next is Dandy Andy, followed behind them by uh, Dinky Flyer. Then Tristram, March Akita, Aberini, Drawn, Society Bay, Inframata and Roman Artist. The crowd is roaring its head off. The judges call for the photo.